Got this place looking nice. Yes, it is. Is that Bella? She's so big now. I've missed her. Does she ever ask about me? No. I doubt she even remembers you. Look, why are you here? I just wanted to catch up. I wanted to see how you are. Oh, really? It's the first time you've reached out in years. I just thought we could try and put our problems <sighs> to rest. Our problems? If I remember correctly, you're the one that started this. I haven't done anything. Exactly. Mum and Dad treat us differently. With you being the golden child. They started it, but you never did anything to stop them. I'll change the record, Rachel. You've always been jealous when I've accomplished anything. I am jealous. Because no matter what I do, you are always the smarter, prettier, more successful one. They loved you more. You've never stood by me. You've always put yourself first and left me on the sidelines. <laughs> Rachel, you've always been bitter. You're exhausting to be around. The room goes cold and lifeless when you're in it. Is that why you didn't invite me to your wedding? Your own sister? I had to find out through a friend that you've completely cut me out of your life. You know what? I hope you two are happy. God knows with you as a mum, Bella doesn't stand a chance of becoming a decent human being with any empathy but for herself. I hope he leaves you. And I hope Bella does too. Shut up. And then you'll feel the complete and utter loneliness I've felt. Because only then will you truly understand how it feels to be me. Get.